Hey everybody, welcome back to day 13 of Firestar. The scene that my sister Rachel's going to be drawing today is of Firestar and his mate Sandstorm right before the battle with the Dark Forest Cats. I'll read this scene to you now. It's on pages 259 through 260 of The Last Hope. Firestar, Sandstorm hissed. She walked over and stood between Firestar and his clan. This is your last life. You can't risk losing it now. Your clan needs you. They need me to fight. Firestar replied, But what will they do if you're killed? They'll fight harder. Firestar's green eyes glowed. My warriors only have one life, and they're willing to give it up for their clanmates. I'm no different. My place is beside them. Sandstorm pressed her cheek against Firestar's. I love you, she breathed. I love you too, Firestar murmured. Stay with Brambleclaw and guard the camp. He broke away and raced for the entrance. I absolutely love what Firestar says about himself being no different than his clanmates. They have one life and he has one life, and they're all willing to risk it for the clan. This is what makes Firestar different than other leaders. He's not selfish, and he doesn't think that he's better than anyone because he's the leader. Pinestar was selfish with his last life. He wasn't willing to give it up for his clan, but he had devoted his other eight lives to the clan. It's hard to judge. Anyways, I'd love to hear in the comment section down below what you think of Firestar and his willingness to risk all of his lives for his clan. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Make sure to go and check out the video over on the side of my last speed paint. And click that subscribe button so you can always be notified when I make my next video. Alright guys, thank you all so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon with the next speed paint. Bye bye